Well, staying in St. Landry Parish tonight, it's not just school threats causing concern tonight. There's been an alarming surge in gun violence in Opelousas, leaving two dead and another in critical condition in recent days. News 15's Ashley Hamilton joins us live after sitting down with the mayor of Opelousas for a candid one on one conversation about the city's rise in violent crime. Ashley, what did the mayor tell you? The mayor tells me that he was in disbelief after the gunning down of two young women late last week and a weekend shooting right here near a barber shop that left the man clinging for his life. He tells me that the violence has become personal for him as he knows the latest shooting victim. The recent violence on the streets of Opelousas has hit Opelousas Mayor Julius and Sandor hard. He calls it unacceptable and unwarranted. The loss of life like that not only impacts the family immediately, but it, it impacts our community. It, it, it resonates to our community in a, in a negative light. We're tired. Society is tired. Following the double murder of two young women on Ana Clara, Opelousas officers found a man shot in the stomach on South Union Street near Madison Street apparently targeted while leaving his business. The shooters responsible for both of these attacks remain on the loose. I know him, know him really well. I did speak to the young man this morning, walking up to somebody and pulling the trigger and taking their lives. How do you walk away from that and not have any type of remorse? You know, young man's got kids. Would young people blame for some of the rise in gun violence? The mayor is calling on the community to come together and influence local youth to make better choices. These young kids are, are influenced by their friends and the choices that they're making not only impacts the lives of those who may be injured or uh, killed, but what does it do to your life by taking someone else's life? He's urging the city's residents to join him in speaking out against the epidemic on recent violence. Let it be heard, let it be known when you see activities or something that is not warranted, something that we have not been trained to do. If you keep quiet on that, this may impact your family. And you don't want that. None of us want that. As Opelousas police look for the shooters in the latest attack, they're asking if you have any information to please call them. You can remain anonymous and receive a reward. Reporting in Opelousas, Ashley Hamilton, News 15.